Marten, the closest relatives of wolverines. You've come to know by now that the wolverine is an apex predator in its ecosystem. This animal holds no regard for its own safety and bravely charges forward into battle against predators much larger than itself. But can the same be said for its closest relative, the marten? To answer that question, in today's video, we'll be talking about the marten and analyzing how it stands as an apex predator in its own right. History Belonging to the subfamily Gulonini within the family Mustelidae, Martins share their family with other carnivorous mammals, including weasels, otters, and badgers. The genus Martis emerged during the Miocene epoch, an epoch that spanned from approximately 23 to 5.3 million years ago. This places Martins in a lineage that has persisted and evolved over a considerable period, shaping their characteristics to suit changing environmental conditions. The Gulonini subfamily, to which martens belong, is distinguished by their robust build and a preference for forested environments. The taiga, characterized by coniferous and northern deciduous forests, provides the ideal setting for these agile creatures. Their sleek, weasel-like bodies and sharp claws make them well-suited for navigating through dense vegetation and climbing trees, essential skills in their arboreal habitats. However, martens are not limited to a single continent. Instead, they are widely distributed across the Northern Hemisphere. Their range extends from North America to Europe and Asia, encompassing a variety of ecosystems within the boreal and temperate regions. Within their habitats, martens play a crucial ecological role. As carnivores, they contribute to the regulation of prey populations, participating in the delicate balance of the food web. Their semi-arboreal lifestyle allows them to access resources both on the ground and in the trees showcasing a level of ecological versatility that is vital for survival in dynamic environments. In total, there are eight species of marten, which vary in terms of physical characteristics. Physical Characteristics Martens vary in size, but generally they possess a compact and slender body. The length of a marten typically ranges from 50 to 85 centimeters, 1.7 to 2.8 feet, with the tail accounting for a significant portion of its overall length. Their bodies are well suited for navigating through the intricate spaces of forested landscapes, and their agility allows them to move swiftly both on the ground and in the trees. The weight of martens varies among species. On average, they weigh between 1.1 to 3.3 kilograms, 2.4 to 7.3 pounds. This moderate size and weight contribute to their versatility as hunters and climbers allowing them to pursue prey with agility and skill. One of the most distinctive features of martens is their fur, which varies not only between species but also within each species. The pine marten, for example, boasts a rich dark brown fur, often complemented by a cream-colored bib on its throat. The beech marten, on the other hand, exhibits sleek light brown fur with a dark mask around its eyes. The American marten can showcase fur ranging from pale yellow to deep brown, while the sable is renowned for its luxurious, almost black coat. This diversity in coloration serves both practical and evolutionary purposes, providing camouflage in their respective habitats. Martens typically have a pointed face with small rounded ears. Their facial features are adapted for a carnivorous diet, including sharp teeth for hunting and consuming prey. The dark mask observed in some species, like the beech marten, adds a distinctive touch to their facial appearance, aiding in their identification. Martens have relatively small yet keen eyes that contribute to their success as predators. Their eyesight is adapted for both day and night vision, allowing them to navigate their surroundings effectively. The tail of a marten is long and bushy. This tail serves various purposes including providing balance during climbing activities and acting as a signaling tool in social interactions. The bushy nature of the tail also aids in thermal regulation, providing insulation against the cold temperatures often encountered in their native environments. Hunting Weapons Martens are skilled and efficient hunters because they are equipped with a set of physical adaptations and behaviors that serve as effective tools for hunting and survival in their natural environments. Chief among these is their possession of sharp teeth and powerful jaws. With pointed incisors and canines, martens are well equipped to seize and subdue their prey efficiently. The forceful bite of around 380 psi, 
delivered by their powerful jaws, allows them to incapacitate their quarry swiftly, showcasing their prowess as hunters. Complementing their tough teeth, Martins exhibit agile limbs and exceptional climbing skills, constituting another set of essential weapons in their hunting arsenal. These creatures are adept climbers, navigating trees with ease. This skill enables them to pursue prey that seeks refuge in elevated spaces, such as squirrels and birds. Sharp, retractable claws further enhance the Martin's hunting capabilities. These claws serve multiple purposes, facilitating climbing on various surfaces and aiding in capturing prey. Stealth and cunning are also intangible yet potent weapons in the Martin's arsenal. Their ability to move silently and inconspicuously contributes to successful hunting endeavors. Martins are known for their strategic stalking, relying on low profiles and quiet movements to approach prey without detection. Hunting Tactics With all of these weapons in mind, the hunting process of the Martin becomes a methodical and strategic endeavor, finely tuned to its environment and the characteristics of its prey. The hunting process typically begins with the Martin actively exploring its territory. Using its acute senses, it scours the landscape for potential prey, utilizing its keen sense of smell to detect scents and identify potential hunting grounds. This initial phase involves a careful assessment of the environment and the availability of food sources. Once a potential prey item is detected, the Martin transitions into a stealthy stalking phase. Employing its agility and ability to move silently, the Martin approaches its target with calculated precision. This phase is crucial for getting as close as possible to the prey without alerting it to the Martin's presence. The element of surprise is a key component of the Martin's hunting strategy. Utilizing its sharp claws and agile limbs, the Martin ascends trees with ease, often navigating the branches to pursue prey that seeks refuge in the canopy. This climbing ability adds a vertical dimension to the hunt, allowing Martins to access otherwise inaccessible areas. The moment of capture involves a rapid and decisive strike. Employing its sharp teeth and powerful jaws, the Martin seizes its prey, aiming for a quick and efficient takedown. The element of surprise and the Martin's predatory adaptations, including sharp claws, contribute to the capture and subduing process. This phase is marked by a burst of agility and precision. Following a successful hunt, the Martin may consume its catch on the spot or transport it to a secure location for later consumption. Martins are known for their ability to store excess food in hidden locations, creating caches that serve as a reserve during times of scarcity. Diet So what kind of prey does the Martin utilize its hunting tactics on? Well, Martins are skilled hunters of small mammals, and this category forms a significant portion of their diet. Common prey usually includes rodents such as mice, voles, and shrews. Martins are also opportunistic avian predators, preying on birds and their eggs. They may climb trees to raid bird nests, capturing both eggs and nestlings. This behavior is especially prevalent during the breeding season when birds are actively nesting. Insects and other invertebrates contribute to the martin's diet as well, particularly during seasons when these prey items are abundant. Martins may forage for beetles, caterpillars, and other small invertebrates, showcasing their adaptability in seeking out diverse food sources. Social Behavior Martins exhibit a predominantly solitary lifestyle, with adult individuals typically navigating their environments independently. This solitary nature aligns with their hunting habits, allowing them to minimize competition for resources and maintain a self-sufficient existence. Solitude enables them to focus on securing their territory and efficiently pursuing prey without the complexities of group dynamics. Territorial behavior is a cornerstone of Martin social dynamics. Each Martin establishes and defends a distinct territory, a space critical for hunting, breeding, and rearing young. Territorial boundaries are meticulously marked through scent markings, primarily produced by glands on the Martin's abdomen. These scent markers convey essential information, such as the individual's identity, reproductive status, and the demarcation of its territory. Although generally solitary, martins exhibit increased social interactions during the breeding season. This period marks a temporary shift in their solitary lifestyle as individuals seek out mates. Male and female martins may engage in courtship rituals, 
involving behaviors such as vocalizations and scent markings to signal receptiveness. Once mating occurs, the female establishes a den within her territory to raise the offspring. And that's all about the Martin, the closest relative of the Wolverine. Who do you think would win in a fight between the Martin and the Wolverine? Let us know in the comments down below. Also, leave a like and subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.